Hi, Sam. Happy Wednesday, guys. I have just gotten off from work. Your girl took a nice little uh, painkiller. And we are here getting ready to do our weekly cash stuffing. It is going to be Battle of the Boxes today. I know it's Wednesday. I usually do my cozy coffee Wednesdays. But um, I need to get back to my box my boxes because I miss my babies. I miss my boxes. And um, I just, because I've missed Sunday's video, which is Battle of the Boxes, Merry Monday, which is for Christmas cash stuffing. And now today, which is Coffee Wednesday. And before you know, it'll be Friday and I have to do my build a farm. So I want to focus on Battle of the Boxes and then I want to focus on Merry Monday. So we're going to skip Cozy Coffee Wednesday for this week. We'll let the money for that roll into next week. Um, and then we should be kind of up to date with the second week of June. Hope you guys have been doing well. And my voice is starting to come back just a little bit. Caught a travel flu and I was sleeping for like 15 hours. No joke. Down and out. The Disney knocked Disney knock the price, the money, the wind. The, the, it, Disney knocked everything out of me. I the, If you have kids... You need to stay away from Disney. <laughs> I don't know where I think I was going with my little bill of farm money. <laughs> Disney say, where you going with this little couple of dollars, young lady? Go back and go find the rest. Go get your candy box, your birthday box, get all the boxes, put them together, and you still would not have enough money for Disney. Oh my gosh. We're not going to talk about Disney. We're not going to talk about the credit card. We're not going to talk about how I have to, I need to find two jobs to, to pay off <laughs> this money. Oh my goodness. And these kids, like, Disney know how to catch you with the kids. Because they'd be putting on these little puppy eyes. And like, mommy, please, mommy. It's only a once in a lifetime opportunity. We're not going to come back again. We're going to be teenagers. And blah, 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 blah. Anyway, God is good. I'm alive. I'm well. I'm back, thankfully. And I am ready to cash stuff today. So Battle of the Boxes is going to begin right now. First off, we're going to be starting off with the Star Sign Box. If you missed my very first video where I gave you a run through of the six boxes that I'm going to be cash stuffing with the Battle of the Boxes, definitely go and check that video out. I will have that linked in the cards somewhere throughout this video. Definitely go and check the first one out because I kind of explained all of the different boxes and we did a whole run through of each of them. Today, we're not going to be doing a whole run through. We're going to be playing today because I need to save. Your girl got bills to pay. Okay, so what had happened was the first time that we played Battle of the Boxes, we only did one day and we had some cash left over, which is this cash that's inside um, this wallet here. Um, and I have some some fun stuff coming up this week. Um, I might have a lot. I, I might have a video back dropping back to back to back just so that I can catch up. I don't want week two to roll into week three. So if you don't want to watch the video, please feel free to ignore it. Um, but I have some fun stuff. Definitely stay tuned for tomorrow's video, Friday's video, and potentially Saturday's video. I don't know which video is going to be in. Watch them all. Um, okay, so this is the cash that we had left over from last week. I don't even remember how much it was, but thank goodness we have it. Um, okay, we got a couple dollars here. All right, so how much is this? 20, 30. See, I can't even count them on. Disney, <laughs> that's Disney. <laughs> Between Disney and Candy Box, I don't know. I don't know what to do with my life. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20. Okay, so we have 120 rolled over from last week. Now, on a weekly basis, I do cash off 160 euros from my weekly cash flow to go towards my saving challenges. Usually what I would do is I would do like my affirmation challenge. I would do several other challenges um and then allocate some funds but since we are kind of doing these boxes we're doing six boxes guys which is insane um i'm not able to do all of my challenges that's in here see like these are my regular weekly challenges now this is from fiona but i have a box from fiona so i'm sure she doesn't mind that i'm doing the birthday box instead of this one i have the coffee box from maria over it. she's got it so i'm sure she doesn't mind if i might skip this one um, and the scratch off is from Maria as well. This is from Jerry over at One Frugal Introvert. I have a star sign um, box that I'm doing, so I, I can skip this zodiac challenge. 
and I just have some summer saving challenges in here and also message in a bottle is from saving with Alicia I have her chocolate box challenge that I'm doing this month so I'm sure like these are the same persons that I'm I'm just supporting a different challenge than these regular ones however I do still want to do my affirmation challenge I feel like affirmations just help me to stay a little bit grounded and remind me of my goals and, and what I'm focusing on this month so this month I'm telling myself and I'm believing and receiving that I am financially secure and I'll a comfortable future ahead of me all right that is the affirmation for the month of june we're gonna go ahead and take our six out of die and we are gonna roll and we're gonna say well wow i mean it's so much financially secure <laughs> okay that's one and uh, let me get my little let me get my little marker here guys let me get my little marker i um i hope you guys are doing well um all the fun and jokes aside it is the season of sickness. Oh my gosh. I know Maria wasn't feeling well. I think last week it was Brandy. And I think Mari over at Budget and Chaos said she was down and out. So it is definitely the season. The, t the seasons are changing. The weather is changing. Um, Definitely. Okay. All right. I don't know what's going on. But they must know your girl ain't got that kind of cash flow today. Um, It's definitely the season. You need to build your immune system, guys. So uh, just a little you know, putting it out there, um, stay healthy. And I, this also goes back to, um, your sinking funds. I had a health sinking fund and I have a medical sinking fund and I've used those funds because whilst we was away, I had to go, we had to go to the pharmacy. We had to get me some medication because the, the, that fever that came on to me was just so sudden. It was so strong. It just, I did not have the energy. Um, and I needed something to knock me out. So, yeah. Now, where were we before I was rambling off just for a little bit? All right. So this was left over from last week. And then this is the 160 for the second week of June. So we're cash shuffling for my second week of June. 20, 40, 60, 81, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60. Okay. So the cash is all here. We're going to do something a little spicy today, guys. Not that I need any spice in my life. Hopefully, I don't regret it. Um, we're going to do something a little spicy today. We are going to roll a die and see how many cash envelopes for each of my six saving challenge boxes are we going to be doing today. This is the star sign. Next up is going to be my coffee box from Maria. Next is going to be the chocolate box from Saving with Alicia. Next is going to be the birthday box from Frugality's Life. Followed by the magic school from Gigi over at Southern Charm Budgets. And then finally, it is going to be Candy Box. And you guys should be familiar with Candy Box. Shout out to everybody who has been purchasing the Candy Box. I don't know who in the universe is out there telling someone to get the Candy Box. But I appreciate and love you very much. I appreciate it. Now, let's roll this die and see how many of these, how many cards I'm going to be selecting from each of these boxes. Oh, see, this is making me nervous already. I'm <laughs> I'm getting nervous already, guys. Ooh, child, please. Why do I do this to myself? Ooh, thank you, Jesus. Thank you. Thank you so much. Because your girl is getting scared just now. Two. We only need to do two cards today. Okay. All right. So let's get started. We're going to go ahead and give these cards a shuffle for the star sign box. And this is a saving challenge from Pernile, or better known as P. And... This is very much Zodiac themed. I am a Virgo. My birthday is in September. My spouse is also a Virgo. So I don't know how that's working out. I'm the loud one. As you can tell, he's the quiet one. And what's your sign, girl? Tell me what's your sign. What's your flavor? Okay, so we rolled the die, the die and it said that we needed to pick two cards. Here is my two cards. May the stars and may the dice gods be forever in my favor. Let's see what we have in store today. Let's see what Pranile has in store for us today. Roll a die to decide which section and then choose an envelope. Okay, easy enough. So we're gonna so there are six sections in here. One, two, three, four, five, six. We roll a die, and it's just we only need to add one. Thank you. I mean, I say that now. Section two section two so there's only two envelopes here 
One is for 14 and one is for two. So I'm gonna go for the one that says 14 and we're just adding one, so that's gonna make it 15. So that worked out. I am happy with that, very much so. That was an easy one. The dice got, oh, section two been getting all the money. Uh, the dice gods have been very kind to me today. So we are gonna go ahead and we're gonna use purple today so that I could differentiate what I've done so far. Okay, 15 is going into section two. That is now done. Okay, let's put that back inside there. Now, moving on to our second card for the star sign box. And it is Taurus. Now, I don't even, I don't, Taurus. Are we in the Taurus season now? That is so cool. Now, let me see if I can find Taurus. Let me see if Taurus could treat me nice today. Section one. I think that's Pisces or Aquarius. One of them, one of them said. Taurus is the bull. Oh, why you do that? <laughs> I know somebody wasn't going to behave today. All right. Okay. Okay. Star sign box. I see you. So Taurus is going to be 21, but your girl ain't got no queens. We ain't got no coins. So we're going to do actually i did make some prop notes wait a minute your girl i made some prop notes but you know what the point of this is actually that i want to over save so i'm going to save the prop notes for my christmas box because that's really what i made the prop notes for for um when i do my christmas cash stuffing so we're going to put in the 21 because i really want to see like what these boxes forced me to save so taurus is now out of the equation, we're going to go ahead and we're going to deposit 25 in here. And that is it. We are done. Oh, wait, I need to put this inside there as well. All right, star sign box made me save quite a chunk today. Hopefully, I'll have some money left over for my other boxes. All right, that is it for me today for star sign. What am I saying? I'm making it sound like I'm ending the video. That is not it for me today, but that is it for the star sign box. Now we're going to be switching on over to our coffee box. Hello, hello. All right, here we go with our coffee box savings challenge from the lovely Maria. Hopefully she's feeling a little bit better. I was talking with her earlier today. Two of us horse just alike. We twin with the sickness. Um, and I hopefully she's doing, she's going to be recovering soon. Um, it is no joke to be down and under, especially when you have like a YouTube channel and people are relying on you. Not necessarily relying, but I love making videos. I honestly do. All right. Keep moving. Here's a little bit of motivation. Keep moving forward. And you'll never have a reason to look back, guys. Coffee box savings challenge. Here we go. We're going to be picking two cards today from the coffee box. So let's go ahead and give my uh, cards a shuffle. And let's see which country are we going to go to today. For our coffee cash. Why well, I feel like some of these cards missing. Um, I believe one of the kids dropped my box. Because my cards were all disheveled. Everything was all messed up. So somebody been in my room. Messing around. Alright guys. For the two cards. For the coffee box. It is going to be. Jamaica. Woohoo. Yaman. Yeah, and Colombia. Uh, I think just does Colombia speak Spanish? Let me let me let me not say nothing because I'm always saying the wrong thing. Okay, for my Jamaican, that's not even a Jamaican. What is going on? <laughs> Where did the accent come from just now? Okay, never mind. Oh yes, yes sir. Yeah man. Jamaica doing me nice today. Two, only two euros I need to save for Jamaica. I'm very happy about that. We are going to go ahead and put five euros in there because we love Jamaica. Uh, I actually didn't know Jamaica made coffee. That is so cool. Shout out to my Caribbean fam. Um, if you're new to my channel, I am originally from the Bahamas. I am a Caribbean gal, but I do live here in Ireland. So from time to time, you will hear me say dollars. You will hear me say euros. I will sound... I don't know, Irish, I will sound islandy, and I will sound, I don't know, from some place you've never heard of. But that is because there's just so much going on, you know? And the funny thing is, the Irish tell me that I sound American, so I don't know who I am. <laughs> Alright, that's the first one done. And now we're going to go to Colombia. 
which I think is going to okay Columbia taking 10 euros from me today understood I understand it is what it is you gotta do what you gotta do and here we go our first number off of Columbia as well as um, Jamaica so it's nice that we get some a good mix of colors um, a good mix of countries because I think I got Brazil twice already okay 10 euros now going into Colombia and the coffee box is now completed coffee box treated me really nicely today thank you so much coffee box now we're going to I'm just gonna throw them in here I'm gonna shuffle them anyway and we're now done with the coffee box and now we're gonna move on over to the chocolate box Hello, back again okay moving on to the delicious chocolate box created by the lovely saving with alicia and it's so nice to see so many of you participating with so many of these boxes it just makes our little boxes heart melt pun intended here's the delicious chocolate box we are going to go ahead and give these cards a lovely little shuffle shuffle for the chocolate swaffle and we're going to pick our two cards and see what the cards have in store for us today and i'm trying to remember if there were other cards i'm trying to remember if i added in what is going on uh -uh. see why am i getting nervous see the chocolate box about to see the chocolate box is about to do something today the chocolate box is about to do something guys um i just i think cards make me nervous in general and i ain't get the birthday box not candy box yet see okay chocolate box okay i think i've shuffled that quite a bit and just make sure um okay now i do remember alicia said that there was going to be some add-ons coming for the chocolate box as well uh, i don't yet have them but um shout out to anyone if you do not yet have it definitely check out everybody that i mentioned in today's video please do go ahead and check them out okay my two cards for the delicious chocolate box is going to be oh i knew it i knew the chocolate box was making me nervous for something double the eggs i don't know what that means but we're going to go to the recipe and egg hunt oh my goodness this is exciting this is exciting okay double the eggs now we need to go to the recipe card this is exciting guys i love it oh my gracious me oh my i'm just excited okay double the eggs oh the eggs come to take all the money all the money so there's four dollars four euros well it can be any currency so four for each egg but i have to double it which means i need to do eight i don't have eight so we're gonna go ahead we're gonna put ten in here for double the eggs honestly that was exciting so that is now do i cross it off or is there going to be another card for eggs i'm not sure but i have plenty of eggs i need to say i need to put some of them eggs and sell them at the farmer's market and build a farm so that was nice okay so 10 euros is now been done uh we have eggs so far for our brownie recipe well we still need to get the rest of our ingredients so right now we have to wait till we get the rest of the ingredients the next thing that we're going to do is egg hunt time so that means we're going to go to this challenge right here which is the scratch off which i am so excited for okay so with this one when you get the PDF download, you're going to need to add your own scratch off Snickers. Now, say Snickers. What am I talking about? Yeah, scratch off Snickers. And um, when you add your Snickers on to this, it's been such a while. I don't even remember. But um, we're just going to scratch off one. I'm going to go for the middle one. And we're going to see what that one is. Oh, yay. It's a little bow. So that's two okay okay all right okay egg hunt time been nice to me today i didn't get no golden egg today but that's okay okay so we got our first chocolate scratch off okay I do a good job. I didn't do a perfect job, but that's okay. I'm sick. We can, can, we can let that slide. So the icon here corresponds with the amounts down to the bottom here. So we only need to save two euros for this one. We're going to go ahead. We're going to deposit our five euros in there. And that is it. So 
We had just now completed our chocolate box. We got some eggs. Actually, both of them are eggs. How cool is that? We both got, we got two different sets of eggs today. Double the eggs for the recipe. And we also looked for a lovely, delicious chocolate egg. Now it's time for us to go over to the birthday box. Back, back, back again. Birthday box is here to help us save money. <laughs> Honestly. Now, I did say birthday box is, is one of, of candy box cousins. So we can see today. Oh, this is what I got last time. Happy birthday with, with her expensive self. Is this the only one that I've done? Yeah, actually, I only did one card, didn't I? Okay, so we're going to shuffle these cute little um, mini cards that Fiona over at Frugality's Life has made for us. And we're going to go ahead. We're going to pick two cards because... That's what the die told us that we're gonna do. We're gonna pick two cards. And I promise you, I'm not looking. I'm just making sure they're nicely shuffled. There we go. All right, let's see what the birthday box is having for us today. Two cards down on the deck. First one is going to be, we have some, sh oh! find the icon and save two times the amount. Why is it that? Why is it that? Second card, find the icon and save the amount. Okay, we got some birthday balloons today. <laughs> These cards make me so nervous, guys. Send help. Okay, send champagne. Send cocktails. Send all the rum. <laughs> Find the icon and save. Listen here. Listen. Let me see what you want to get for us today. Uh, okay, section one. Birthday balloons and champagne. I don't see it. Okay, no. Section two. Mm, mm, mm. Be back to section two again. Section two is the plug. Okay, section two. The champagne is actually 10. So it tells us that we need to save two times the amount. So we're going to be putting in 20 euros. See, all the boxes taking the money today. Um, Coffee box was the only one who's behaving nicely today. Okay, we got some champagne popping over here. And uh, we have to double that one. So this card can go face up this way and we can go ahead and put this back now we just need to look for the birthday balloons and let's see what that amount is going to be okay is that in properly yes that's in properly okay great now let's see what these birthday balloons uh section three it has some balloons but the balloons are a little bit different would have loved to have that that one's only five euros Okay, moving on to section four. Ooh, that's a high one, eh? Boy, these are some numbers on here. These are some numbers on here, buddy. Section four doesn't have any. Oh, my goodness. Section five does not have it. So, it must be on... Oh! Why is it at? <laughs> Birthday box is now in the lead for the most expensive box that I had to save for today. 20. I feel like I had this car before. Did I not have this car before? 25. I probably didn't have this car before because there's no cash in there. So what I had before. Oh, I had this one. Mm -mm. Okay, guys, we are saving a whopping 25 for some lovely balloons for the birthday box savings challenge absolutely incredible oh we get or i was supposed to say we get a more small change 25 going into the birthday box into section six that was quite fun all right that is it for the birthday box for now uh, i think the birthday box is in the lead for how much who i've saved the most money with so far i think um but they've all been pretty much in the 20 to 40 range all right, moving on to the School of Magic. Guys, back again with the School of Magic, which I absolutely love because it's so different. It's so unique. She did send me some extra add-ons. Um, I did print them out. I have not yet laminated. There's some extra cards that she came out with. And I do believe she recently came out with year two to let you know what to look forward to once you're finished with this and some other freebies. Honestly, I need just, I just need to laminate them and I'll definitely be showing them in one of the upcoming videos. But um, this is from Gigi over at Southern Charm Budgets. Um, it is just absolutely fun and magical. So let's see what the cards have in store for us today. 
let's see and um it's so creative guys this one is just this is really a creative one she really did um did go all out for this one and i love it um it's definitely going to save you some money and it's definitely going to keep you busy so oh i love them and i love the size like you see how each one is different like these ones there's a nice big grip to them and then with the owner it's nice and petite and cute and everything and then you know all of the cards they all have um you know their own special each of these boxes have their own special touch to them so let us see how magical these cards are going to be for us today our first magical card is going to be oh is that a phoenix i think so we are going to getting the phoenix today I feel like I did the Phoenix already, did I? And then the next card is going to be... Ooh! Something very um, Zodiac-y, Celestial. Now, how am I to know which... I guess I have to look through. If I had to guess which one of these sections... Herbology, maybe not. Magic Rule, Sky High Lessons, maybe. Shapeshift and Stargazing. Stargazing probably would be this one. And I'm going to, I don't know, maybe shape shifting. So let's just go through the through each section. So it's not magical herbology, which is fine. And it's not the magic brews, which is fine. It's not sky high lessons because these are all broomstick flying objects related. Okay, so I was correct then. Shape shift. Oh, it's not shape shifting either. Okay, okay, excuse me. I got to get my terminologies correct. So this one is stargazing, which I did say, which I did um, guess that it would be. So this one is $6 for this one. This card matches that. So we are going to go ahead and put in 10 euros for this one. All right. We're going to take that one off the board. So this one is now done. All right. So again, this one, this one, this one is a nice one. This one behaves very well. I love the numbers. The numbers are pretty low. And okay, so that's that. And then the next one is this one here, which is only one dollar as well, which is very nice. So for this one, we're gonna go ahead and put in five euros um, for that. And let's go ahead and take this one off of this one. All right. There we go. Easy peasy, lemon squeezy. And another one is done. Yay. Okay. So that's those two done from the School of Magic. Magic box. That, I love to call it magic box. All right. So I'm just going to put those ones down. I probably got the other cards mixed up. All right. Last and not least. Last but not least. It is going to be the most... Oh, the most difficult box that I've done in my entire life. It is going to be the candy box. Righty, all righty. Candy box is here. Candy box is here. It's candy box time. It's candy box time. Is candy box going to take its throne and take it back from birthday box, who is trying to dethrone candy box by making it become the most savings box for this week? So can candy box clean its throne? Is it going to be the one that makes us save the most money? Or is it going to be Fiona over at the birthday box? All right, we're going to go ahead and take these cards out. Give them a nice little shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. And it was so entertaining watching uh, Portia's video the other day. And <laughs> with her candy box. Listen, you just don't know. You just don't know which way it's going to go. It can go up and down, sideways, upside down, inside out, all kind of ways. So again, we are going to be picking two cards, just two, dos, un, do, dos. What are, how else do you say? Uh, un, do, yeah, I think that's French. What do you say in German? I don't remember. And in Spanish is dos, and French is do, I think. <laughs> right, okay, two cards for the win, candy box. First card is add two euros to the next two card. Well, motorbike, um, <laughs> I ain't picked the two cards yet. Okay, so I still have to pick two cards. This is just one of those cards to just add I, these little sugar rushes. Please do not be a jawbreaker. I can't take it right now. Candy box cards. Oh my, what is? 
Add one dollar to the next card. I shuffle this deck properly, eh? See, I get an anxiety all over again. <laughs> we are ready. Older six year olds, and we even start playing yet. I could feel my heart beating in my ears. You know when you about to pass out? <laughs> Scoop fee, add one dollar. Okay, we'll we'll take it. Let me just I'm gonna put these cards down because let me just Okay, when we get a card like this, we roll a die and see which one of the sections we're gonna go to. So we are gonna go to section three. Okay, okay, section one, section two, section three. Section three only has one envelope remaining because we already did the first one. Why are we still going to all of the sections that we did last week? Isn't that not strange? Like, we're literally on all of my challenges. Well, except, no, I didn't go to the same section in Magic School. We went to a new section. And we did this new section inside Coffee Saving Challenge. Okay, it's fine. So, nine is left. What we have here on the board is that we needed to add one dollar, one euro to this one. This is our current card. That makes it ten. Then we needed to add two, and we also needed to add one. So, in total, it was going to be nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen all together. I don't have um, any small trees, guys. Sorry about all the noise. Some of the kids just came walking through the door and they are just a little bit loud. Anyway, so all together, it should be 13. I don't have any one. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna put in 15 for cash envelope number nine. Okay, so we've added the cash in here. We're now done with this card. So now what we're going to do is we're going to put this back in here. We don't need this anymore, right? We still have one more card to pick. And with the, whatever that card is, we're going to add the two and we're going to add the one because we still have a sugar rush going on. Okay, I'm trying to figure out if I want to still pick the cards or if I want to shuffle this deck. I'm going to shuffle the deck, guys. Sorry. <laughs> I don't know what the future holds. I don't know. You know, you just, you need, I should, I, next time, I'm just going to keep shuffling. Shuffle. I'm not going to pick the cards back to back. I'm going to shuffle them. All right, let's see what we have going on here. Just sweethearts. Lovely. Just sweet. Oh, is this? Oh, okay. Well, it is 21. Um, plus two plus one, which is three. So I need to add three plus the 21, which is 24. So we're going to be putting in 25. Now I feel like, yeah, I feel like, um, we have been dethroned this week. I feel like, um, the birthday box has taken the majority of the cash today. We have been dethroned guys. We have been dethroned. <laughs> I think that's what we I think that's the box that we saved the most in. I think we saved like 40 something in that one, which is not too bad. Candy box right behind. Star sign box also right behind as well. Not a bad day. Not a bad day for saving. Alright, that is now done. We can go ahead and put this card back inside there. Our sugar rush is also done as well. And we can put those cards back in there as well so we were able to get all of our boxes we, we were able to give all of the boxes some love today and we still have cash left over and again we're gonna let this roll over into the next week i'm just gonna put this cash back into um my little pouch right here because i will be back on sunday for the regular candy boxes you know we play candy box usually on sundays and i'll be right back again for the third week of june for our bottle of the boxes okay that's it for me today guys i hope you enjoyed today's video it's good to be back missed you guys lots of love to you guys and i will see you in my next video